I'm Leo Volzamer, head of the Advanced Concepts team, and we're in the business of exploring the future. We do this by challenging the status quo and coming up with radically new ideas of how to do things in space in the future. We do this by recruiting research fellows, which are postdocs for two years, into the team, and they essentially come up with what they think is important for the future of ESA, challenging what we currently do. Well, our, our time horizon is starting when the current ESA planning horizon stops. It's beyond the, the current planning horizon of ESA. Typically, these are topics that don't have an immediate return, but that prepare the future. One of these ideas uh, is related to the Galileo system, which is like the US GPS system, Europe's own navigation system. It is a system that is based on extremely stable clocks to give you time and location information. And the question we asked was, well, couldn't we base the whole system entirely on the correct Einsteinian metric instead of adding relativistic correction terms? And it was, of course, an academic research to start with uh, until the fifth and sixth Galileo satellites were launched into wrong orbits. Wrong because non-circular, slightly elongated orbits, which are not ideal for the Galileo constellation, but which are just perfect to test one of the predictions of Einstein. And one of these predictions was that time is influenced by gravity. So since these satellites move away from the Earth and come closer in their elliptic orbits, we proposed, together with the navigation directors, with whom we, with which we worked before already for quite some time, to design an experiment that for one year uses these satellites to test this prediction of Einstein from 100 years ago. And it's a good example of something that will be useful in the future in any case, because such a system uh, has many other advantages, turned out to be much earlier useful than we had ever predicted.